On Thursday, November 12, I signed a contract with Brinks Monotronics. Um, on Friday, they installed the system. Right after installing the system, we started having issues. I brought it up to their attention. I was told um, they were going to send a technician over to my home, but nobody called or nobody came to my house. Well, on Thursday, November 12th, um, I met with Danny and Kevin. They were the salesmen for Brinks. Um, they introduced their product and their services to me. And also I, I um, told them about my issue before with, with Monotronics, which is Brinks now, because I was with them before. And they reassured me that everything would be fine. I wouldn't have any issues anymore. And that's the reason why I signed a contract with them this time. After installing the system, we started having issues. Um, I texted them. I told them because we had problem with the volume that it was not working very well. Um, They said, oh, it's just a matter of adjusting the the settings. So I said, which is fine. And then um, the next thing you know, um, the alarm went off at 3.30 in the morning. We couldn't hear it. Um, I told them about it. Um, they didn't do anything. Nobody called us. There was no, um, um, nobody from Brinks called or come on the system and said, hey, are you guys okay? It's nobody. And then um, third problem, I asked them to program the system to automatically arm at 11 p.m. and disarm at 6. Nothing was done. And that's when I called them. And um, I was told there's nothing they can do about it. I have to talk because I told them I need to cancel. I'm, I'm over it because we waited for days and weeks for them. It's not like we denied them to fix the system, but I give them time. But they've been ignoring us. He said nothing was done at all. So I called Brinks and I was told to call Skyline if I want to cancel because there's nothing they can do about it because of the contract. So I called Skyline and they were giving me the runaround. Like, okay, if you're going to do that, you're going to be penalized. You have to pay for the system or sell it to someone else. I'm not going to sell a system that doesn't work. So um, that's when I started making noise. I mean, if, if I didn't make all this noise, they wouldn't do anything. But nothing was done. They were saying that they, um, they walk with me, you know, with the system. No, it's a lie because nobody called me and said, hey, you know, somebody is going to bring the equipment for you to get it fixed. Because I was promised a technician was going to come over and fix it. But nobody called, nobody came. I just want to get out of contract without no option. I mean, I, I don't, I can't see myself for something that doesn't work. Um, if I didn't make any noise, they wouldn't, they started calling me. They started sending me texts. The alarm, my alarm is an arm. I didn't ask them to send me texts. I told them to set it for me because I don't have access to their online system. I asked for help because my account was locked. Nobody responded. And it's just frustrating, you know, because nothing is solved. I'm, I reach out to my attorney and Brinks didn't respond to them. Um, Skyline respond to the attorney that I'm that's helping me in California, but um, the story is not. It's it just um, they made me look like I'm a liar. I would say the be careful, not just to trust anybody out there. Um, I think I got sold because of their panel, the look of their panel. It was it was nice. Um, but then the system doesn't work as I expected.